Let's work on getting students access to a class website. Um, it turns out nobody on the school site actually has access to the web page, as far as my understanding. So this is a shortcut that I did to give my students access because I didn't actually do have an option to do that either. Um, but I wasn't aware of this at the time or I would have covered this in the session. So if, when I want to get students access to this easily, like in the middle of class or something, I'm going to click the share button. Oops. Give it a name. And I want to click advanced. And I get all these options. Right now it's private. I don't want it private anymore. You need to change that. And I actually want it, I don't want it anybody in my school district. I want anyone with link. Right? So that way even parents that aren't signed into their Chrome account. And I just want it set to can view. I could change it to edit, but I don't want that. I just want to keep it at view and press done. the very top I'm going to copy the address and then I'm going to go to Google URL shortener and that will give me a short URL for this really long one so if I paste in the address so I'm going to, again I copied the URL at the top of my class document and I go to Google URL shortener paste in the address right here and it says get shortened URL and then I want to copy that. So at the very top, I can just put, and all I need to give my students is the URL without the HTTP stuff. And I can make this bigger. So this is now a shortened URL that will always take my students to this page. But the nice part about this one is, I can actually write that down on my board starting at the goo.gl and then over here caps matter. Okay, so now I can just put it up on my board in the front of class and say everybody type in this address to get to the daily website and then I can just leave it up on the board all year long. And that's a pretty good start until it gets linked to the website.